open, fam. We are back in the warehouse for Yo MTV Red. That's what I'm talking about. My name is Young Raja, a.k.a. Thambi Raja from Singapore. Give it up for the all-round Betty, the beautiful Kim Lee. What's poppin', guys? I'm hella excited to be here to see the raw, uncut Asian hip-hop from all over the world. There's so much more coming. We have our game master, Zamira, putting rappers to the test on what's good. You never know, you come in like a ninja. Like a ninja? We're keeping it 100 with the boy way. If anybody knows, you know. This is way old school. And Joe Flizzle as our very own cypher boss. We got boss for y'all, y'all ready? Every episode, we're gonna give you rap, Music, fashion, money, and of course, culture. So let's keep this train moving, repping Bangkok all day. Give it up for the, the Boy, Boy Way! Three, two, one. Think about that lifestyle, that bag, I'ma get it. Set up my swag if you ain't trying to get it And that's the difference between me and you Be same thing, same thing Every night, every night, every night So baby, no, I'm making moves. You know they said he hating and my paper keep on smiling. Catch me in New York or somewhere posted on the island. Party every day, like it's a celebration. Trying to get your way with only good vibrations. Watch me turn my dreams into my family's pot of gold. We on the road, we round the globe, we international. Together singing, we live to love and love to party. Party to love and love to live. Wherever we get a chance, we take advantage. Been shining down since we were kids. Let's get gone to the dog, go all the way in. I on a night like this. Parking lot to the spot, the four seasons. Just champagne, some. We can ride together singing day 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 day
I'm in downtown LA right now. I'm about to meet Stupid Young. For those that don't know, he's the next hottest thing in Asian hip hop. Not just Asian hip hop, hip hop in general. He's got 24 million views on YouTube. He's all over world star hip hop, no jumper. We're about to go chill with him. Let's go. I appreciate it, for sure. Can you eat spicy? Yeah, hell yeah. Can? Yeah. Oh yeah, you Cambodian. Cambodians can eat spicy. Southeast Asian, yeah. Hell yeah. This shit, fire. How do you feel about, like, you know, Asian hip-hop and, like, you know, Asian rappers finally getting recognized? I feel, see, I feel happy about it. I'm, uh, it's a proud moment. It was good to see a lot of Asian rappers on the rise. So, Stupid Young, how did you come up with that name? My street name is Young. Mm -hmm. So I wanted my rap name to be Young Something, but Swiss was like, man, it's too much Young Something and Young G, Young Jock. Like, me and my mom didn't have a good relationship growing up, and then I remember when I was young, she'd be like, man, you'll never be a rapper. Stupid. And shit. Oh, wow. So then I just, I just stuck with it, and then uh, it became Stupid Young. So how does your family feel about you, you know? They proud now. Yeah. Let's go shoot some hoops real quick. All right, here you go. A hundred for right, you, cash. All right, right here. Cold, hard cash. A hundred. We're going to eat Korean barbecue with this. You, you got to Instagram this. It, it's got. Right there. Woo! I'm a woman of my word, so here's $100 cold, hard cash. Oh, again. <laughs> So tell me, like, how did you get into hip hop and like how old were you when you first um, you know? I like the music since I was young. How you? I grew up in a gambling house. I was the only kid in there because I don't know where my mom and dad was. And I used to sit in front of the TV and watch like BET and MTV and all that shit. And then I just I just came out with it like when I got a little older after I got out of jail. So we got a lot of fans looking up to you, you know. What what's your advice to inspiring rappers, artists out there? Just, just chase your dreams. Cause I, a lot of people, I remember, I never thought I'd be um, in the position I am today. One more time, one more time. Right there. Oh, oh. You play piano? Wow. Oh my god. Right, let's see, let's see your skills. Okay, let me teach you how to play. But you know what, what this is, right? Like the No, nah, I don't know nothing. I don't know no minor, major, none of that. Oh, no. right, we're about to make a, a beat right now. <laughs> I got Kim Lee right next to me. They ain't never seen an Asian sauce with this recipe. Sober right now, I think I need some Soon a little episode right for MTV. They ain't never seen an Asian like this on MTV. Oh, they ain't never get the best of me. Stupid young, but they call me Young Shadow. I got homies in the hood playing with keys like pianos. I stomp you off in some Gucci sandals. I leave your ass crushed like a camel. Look. <laughs> It's your boy, Stupid Young. I'm with Yo! MTV Raps. You tuning in. Let's go. Yes, that's right. Give it up. 14 gold. My buzzer broke. Excuse us. It's all just excuses, people. Who should we look out for? The boy, Wayne. Hey. <laughs> Today, we got four talented MCs that flew in from all over the world. Let's go! And we're back at it again. Give it up for our resident DJ queen, Kim Lee. People like to act like they know everything about hip hop. Well, we're gonna put everyone to a hip hop test. This is What's Good! Woo! This madness definitely needs a master. Give it up for Zomira! <laughs> Hello, humans. I'm gonna be your host for What's Good. So get ready. Today we got our rappers battling for ultimate bragging rights. Winner gets the golden trophy. <laughs> On Team Red, we've got Korean lyricist ready. <laughs> Repping the American Chinese duality, Bohan Phoenix. Give it up one time. On Team Gold, we've got swagging it out for the Philippines, flip top king, Abra. From the train via Bangkok, by way of Northern Cali, give it up for Radio 3000! Yeah. All right, before we get started, why don't you test out your buzzers? <laughs> <laughs> Sounds good to me. Hip-hop is a genre that constantly reinvents itself over the years. However, 
One thing that hasn't changed is a dope album cover. We're gonna show you a series of albums with the artists removed. So y'all gotta look back and guess the artist. Three, two, a one. Do you know who that was? Okay, come on, Team Red, you got Cardi it. Cardi B, baby. Cardi yeah. B, that's right, you know. All right, All right. go back to the bay. Right. Ooh, All right. you're leaving for New York. Next one, go. Gold. Rich Brian. Rich Brian, that's right. Okay, last question. Three, two, one, turn around. Ding, 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 ding. Oh, okay. Team Red. Who's 21 that? Savage. 21 Savage! Yeah. Team Red has got it on lock. The score is Team Red with two points and Team Gold with one point. We want to come back from, you know, from yeah. losing, then come back and win the game. Oh, of course. Yeah. You, know, you never know. You come in like a ninja. Like a ninja. That's right. Next question, let's get it. As a rapper, I know my beats, but how well do you know your beats? When producers talk about the parts of a beat, they use specific words. A kick drum is one of them. Name three other parts of a beat. Go! <laughs> team Go! Bass, hi-hat, and snare. Yes, that's right. Give it up for Team Go! I heard that somewhere. My buzzer broke. Oh, your buzzer uh -huh. broke? <laughs> Excuses. It's all just excuses, people. <laughs> all right. Are you guys ready for the next one? It was recently announced that Takashi 69 may have to go into witness protection after he finishes his prison sentence. In his honor, we're going to show you a series of face tat close-ups, okay? So y'all gotta look back yeah. to see the tattoo and guess the artist. Are y'all ready? Ah. Oh, shit. Post Malone. Post Malone. Post Malone. Next one. Three, two, one, go. Wow. Team Gold. Goo Wop. Gucci Mane. Oh, yeah, Team Gold. Team Gold, you are on I told a you. fight, you We coming back. Are you guys ready? Yeah. Three, two, one, shabam. Bill Wayne. Yeah. how these rappers got a party on their faces. We're gonna put 20 seconds on the clock and each team is gonna draw a face tattoo on one of the audience members. So we've got two audience members ready for y'all. Come on out here. Representing, that's right, representing. And here are your markers. Y'all ready? Come on, boys, take some of these. Are you ready? Yeah. Three, two, one, go! Pick a winner. I can't I do got this you, girl. Oh, I got you. I can't have you myself. Okay, oh, team red. Oh, that's a that's a Korean yeah. dollar sign, that's right? Dollar sign. Oh that's wow! Dollar. All sure. about the money. Oh, oh, what, yeah. do, what do we have that? And MTV. Oh, they got the MTV yeah. though. Right. Yeah, no. All right, what we got going on over here? Okay, let's look yeah, at let's the uh, team gold. Is that an ice what? cream cone or a mic? It's what a is mic. that? It's a microphone. It's, it's supposed to be a smiley face, but it. Oh, it looked like a half-eaten Pac-Man. Yeah, is that a suitcase or is that a... It's a radio. Oh. <laughs> is this suitcase 3,000? <laughs> anyway, we got to choose. Let's go. It's easy. And the winner is... Team Go! Thank you. I want to thank my mom, first of all. Next up, uh, we saw a killer performance earlier, and now we're going to pop over to the lounge and keep it 100 with our special guest, The Boy Way. Yeah. Way, that was a dope performance. Like, thank you, you killed that. Thank Bro, you. I have so many questions to ask you, man. Yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm, I've been a fan of you for a long time, man. Appreciate like, it. How is it like? 
constantly reinventing and like pushing the flame forward? Well, first of all, like I've been blessed to really like do what I love doing. Mm -hmm. I enjoy doing this. And I feel like, you know, as long as we're here, we should keep ourselves like open-minded and want to learn new things and always try to reinvent yourself. Awesome. You gotta keep up with the trends and, you know, just try to find a different outlet of how to like, you know, release your thoughts. Yeah. You got that fire energy that I love on stage. What do you do to like, you know, prepare for your shows and how do you keep the crowd hype? When I hit that stage, you know, my mentality is I have to win that crowd. Yeah. Wherever I'm at, if it's 20 people, if it's 30 people, right. if it's 1,000 mm -hmm. people, yeah. I have to win that crowd and I have to make sure that I go home and I feel like I killed it. So that's dope. That's my mentality. I like your way of thinking. <laughs> Bro, you know what? I'm going to just quickly segue and tell you that we've got great snacks. Okay, I'm going to yeah. try this. It's called the Muruku. I grew up eating these. I grew up eating this. Oh, for real? This is like, if anybody knows, you know. This is <laughs> way old school. What is this? Is this from China? It's like sugar paper. A sugar paper. <laughs> it's like sugar paper. I like that. Bro, I also have something else to ask you, man. Yeah, man. You know, I'm a new rapper, so like, we always look up to guys like you. Appreciate that. And like, recently you went solo. Mm -hmm. How's that coming along, bro? I mean, shout out to Titania and the brothers, you know? Rocky shows, I live a life for rock and roll. We never stop, we go. Titania, about to know. Being with someone or a group of people for so long, yeah. you know, there's, there's times where definitely gotta grow. Oh, yeah. You definitely got to grow and people, you know, live their own lives and, and have other goals. So, you know, it was just a, a dream of mine just to, to have an album of my own. So, yeah. Just That's dope. Me. What do you think about the new school, guys? Oh, I love the new school. You know, they bring, they bring a vibe, a fresh a fresh energy. And music, at the end of the day, is, is a vibe. Yeah. It makes you feel something. Even yeah. if, like, you know, some people might not be able to understand it, but yeah. then mm -hmm. I don't understand Malaysian right, rap, right. you know, because I don't speak Malaysian, yeah. but it's a vibe. Exactly. I, I could rock with it. Yeah. Yeah. As long as you can feel it, music is, like, universal. Asian hip-hop scene is booming. People are coming out of every country yeah. in this region, flexing with their flavor, you know? And Thailand is so dynamic. There's so many talented rappers. Yeah. And who should we look out for? I mean, yo, the scene is crazy right now. First of all, you got a shout out to Two Piece Southside. <laughs> Young Ohm is killing it. <laughs> Fixed. <laughs> Young Goo, Young Bong, your boy TJ, the boy Way. <laughs> shout out, bro. Yo, Way, thank you so much for blessing us with your presence, man. I'm really excited for your new stuff. Coming up next, we have four different rappers from four different countries about to murder it in a cypher. Let's go. Let's go. Welcome to the Yo MTV Rap Cypher. This is your boy Joe Flizzo. And today we got four talented MCs that flew in from all over the world. First up, we got Abra representing Basic City, Philippines. All the way from Seoul, Korea, we got the homeboy Ready representing California, currently residing in Bangkok. We got Radio 3000. And last but not least, representing Chengdu in New York, we got Bohan Phoenix. We got bars for y'all. Y'all ready? Let's go. Yeah. Finally, it's the world stage. First up, Mr. First Place. Jerk face with a diverse face. First day to get to third base. You a bird place in a bird cage. I'm an airplane through a hurricane. Burn blaze, her pace. Modern day Shakespeare with a word play. Yeah. I'm for a new age. Take a suitcase down to endure hate. Take a ticket to fame. Side to side with the Asian crew. Eye to eye with a raging bull. With part of my face, I'm a stand ground. Man up, then hut, never back down. Too damn proud, back to go back. Yeah. Hi, my name is 
Ravens radio three thou out. Well, I got three thousand styles true, and the drip might drown you. Like you took a dip in a six feet pool. Oh, a magical mic like Bulls versus Lakers back in 1989. Yeah, and they saying I'm next up, and they ain't never been more right. I've been around the world a hundred times with my Habibis. I was in Dubai, Swati Cop Capo Capo speaking Thai. Think God even know you loving the vibes. Mama, I made it. I told you I do it. I'm rapping on MTV. Finally get to flex. This been my dream ever since I was like three. Hey.